Hello and welcome to a Poker Smith with some numbers. I am a Smith and today we are opening up something a little bit different. So hopefully in this package I have an authentic version of Pokemon Soul Silver from the DS and I will be able to show you uh, what what to look out for to get a legit version and if it turns out to be a fake then I can kind of point you into the direction as to what makes it a copy rather than the authentic version. Okay, I don't know what's inside this, whether it comes with the box or not. I think it's just the game cartridge. Uh, I have got it from a company in the UK called uh, CEX. So if it is a copy, I will be able to return it, get a refund, or hopefully swap it out for one that's a proper version. So, okay, let's uh, get into this. I'm quite excited, but quite nervous at the same time. I'm hoping, hoping it's all okay. And then, yeah, we'll, we'll get into the details of what makes it a authentic original copy. Okay, so there's a case here. That's pretty cool. I wasn't expecting a case. That is pretty awesome. So, so far, good sign. So that will be my invoice and all that. So there is the case. Which is, you know, looking, looking worn. We've got a bit of scuffage there. So I don't mind that. Looks like a legit case, but obviously you can get legit cases with um, with copied copied copies in there. So let's open this up. Okay, so far so good. Quite happy with the way that's looking so far. Okay, so let's just pop this out there. Get a closer look. Okay, get that to focus. So yeah. As we were, first thing to look for, for a, a legit copy, if you're just looking at the, the front, it's also difficult on some of these things if you don't have a fake copy next to it. But looking, they've got the color right here on the label. It's it's like a, like a proper silver. It's not bluey or anything. The, the, text of soul silver should have that white sort of background to it as you can see there the this is obviously a european copy so you've got the ce there ntr ipgp euro which is which is correct uh, i think the american one's the same apart from it has usa at the top there try and get a look at this logo here it's hard to pick up on camera but it does look authentic there because sometimes they'll be a bit blurry or uh, just not lined up properly okay so just looking at the case again there should hopefully be an indentation on the top so let's see if we can get a look there there is like a little difficult to get uh, the um, focus on here so we'll try that again not sure if we're picking it up, but there is, there we go. You can see that's it. There we go. There's that little indentation there. So that's another good sign. I think that's all to look at for, for the front. Obviously you want to be looking at a closer look at the, uh, the Nintendo logo, but it's hard without a comparison because the text would be different sizes, different sort of quality so if we're just going off you've got one cartridge and we're trying to find out if it's real or fake these are the things you can look for so if you flip it over there we go so we've got the NTR followed by three numbers which is correct uh, IPGP on the back there and yeah, it's not it's not like indented, it is just that's that's pretty much how it should look. Um yeah, you can get different variations, but again it's hard to tell. And on the gold bit the IRC with numbers is also what you're looking for there. 
so really this is uh from all the tests so far a legitimate original copy which is awesome it means i don't have to send it back there is one more test that you can do which is you've probably seen everywhere is the the light test so we'll go grab a light shine it behind and hopefully you'll see like a um, violet -y, purple sort of color coming through there so we will go and take grab a light and take a look okay so all my torches have been packed up in the shed uh so i've got this little little uh light here not sure if it's going to work but let's see so it's quite dark there and then there we go there's a slight change in the light there so there you go you can't see anything through it and there you go you can see a sort of purpley yeah there we go you can see through it so that is kind of what you're looking for there is to see see that color through the cartridge and there you go there you have it you have a legitimate version of pokemon soul silver which is awesome so yeah that is it uh, obviously the last test you can do is put it in your your console so yeah when i was growing up i got the um i had heart gold and i've always wanted uh soul silver well i had i had gold yeah the original gold and then uh, when it came around to uh soul silver heart gold i never got them so yeah, I'm pretty stoked to get this version. I'm sure I'll be playing that soon. Yeah, hopefully those little hints will help you find your authentic version of Pokemon. Soul, Silver and Heart Gold. So I hope you enjoyed that video, that opening. A little bit unusual. Um no tcg today thought i'd go uh go down the video game route or route as american friends might say so there you go there is the video on how to find out if you have got an authentic version or how to look for an authentic version of soul silver uh obviously that's the european version of the game but uh most things are pretty similar uh, the key one is is the light Hopefully it runs right. Yeah. And always remember to obviously drink coffee, stay awake, stay alive. Most importantly, like and subscribe. Thank you very much for making it to the end of another video. I hope it helped.